Hi kids! So today we are going to discuss about comparison and arrangement of decimal numbers. There are three ways in comparing decimal numbers. The first one is by using a number line for small scale, while the second one is the difference between the numbers and place value chart for numbers that cannot be represented in a number line. The third way is by adding zero to evenly make the digits of decimal numbers. After going through this lesson, you are expected to compare and arrange decimal numbers. So we have here a place value chart. So yung una nating number is 3 and 756,000. Next, 37 and 5600. So we have here 375 and 6. Tenths and last natin is 3,756,000. So, if we are going to arrange these numbers in ascending order, pag sinabi natin ascending order, yung pinakamalik na number muna, palaki ng palaki. So, ang gagawin natin, tingnan lang muna natin yung whole number part. So, pag sinabi natin whole number part, yung Nasa left side ng decimal point. So, ito yung decimal point natin. So, yung left side natin ay ito. So, ito yung ating whole number part. So, ano ba yung pinakamaliit na D yan sa ating whole number part? So, pinakamaliit yung 0. So, ibig sabihin, mauna yung ating 3,756,10,000. So, next natin is 3. So, 3 and 756,000. So, ano bang susunod natin? So, susunod natin sa 3 is yung 37. 37 and 5,600. So, pinakamalaki nating number is yung 375 and 6 tenths. So, again, tinignan muna natin. Ang pinag-compare lang natin muna is yung whole number part. Kung ano yung pinakamaliit, palaki ng palaki. So, yun yung ascending order. We use the symbol less than, greater than, and equal to compare decimals. When comparing two decimals, it is help, helpful to write one below to, to the other. So, example. So, we have here 3 and 675,000 and 3 and 675,000. So, unahin natin yung whole number part. So, since parehas naman siyang 3, ang susunod natin ay yung kauna-unahan natin place value sa decimal numbers. So, that is tenths place. So, yung tenths place nito ay 0. Tenths place nitong isa is 6. So, mas malaki yung ating 6. Therefore, 3 and 675,000 is greater than 3 and 675,000. So, mas malaki itong nasa ilalim natin. 3 and 675,000. Let's have another example. Which is greater? 58 and 23 hundreds or 49 and 35 hundreds. So, the given decimals have whole number parts. So, we are going to compare the whole number parts only. So, those 58 and 23 hundreds, yung whole number part natin is 58. And doon naman sa 49 and 35 hundreds, yung whole number part natin is 49. So, pag pinag-compare natin yung 48 and 58 and 49, mas malaki yung 58. Therefore, 58 and 23 hundreds is greater than 49 and 35 hundreds. Let's compare the following decimals by writing greater than, less than, or equal. So number 1, we have 1 and 396 thousands. And then, ito naman is 95 hundreds. So, ang una natin titignan yung whole number part. So, we have here 1. Ito naman kabila is 0. So, ibig sabihin, mas malaki kong 1 and 396,000. So, 1 and 396,000 is greater than 95 hundreds. Next, number 2. 
we have 29 hundredths. Compare natin doon sa 3 tenths. So, 0 yung whole number part natin. Wala tayong whole number. So, ang titignan natin is yung tenths place. So, tenths place nito is 2. Ito naman ay 3. So, ano mas malaki? 2 or 3? Diba mas malaki yung 3? So, ibig sabihin, 29 hundredths is less than 3 tenths. So, ang pinagbasihan natin is yung tenths place. Kahit ito ay may 9 dito, ang titignan natin is yung tenths place, 2. Tenths place nito is 3. Mas malaki yung 3. So, ibig sabihin, 29 Hundreds is less than 3 tenths. Next, number 3. We have 6 and 5 tenths and 6 and 500 thousands. So, pareha siya ng whole number, 6. Next natin is yung tenths place, 5. Tenths place, 5. So, yung sumunod na na digits natin ay 0. Ito ay wala na. So, ibig sabihin, parehas lang siya ng value. So, 6 and 5 tenths is equals to 6 and 500 thousands. Next, let's arrange the given, de given decimals in ascending order. Ascending means you are going to arrange the decimals in increasing order. So, ibig sabihin maliit, palaki, ng palaki yung digits. So, we have here 1 and 7 tenths. 9 tenths, 1 and 7 hundredths, 1 and 9 tenths, and 7 tenths. So, unahin natin yung whole number part. So, kung ito ay 1, 1, 1, so mas maliit yung 0. So, we have 9 tenths and 7 tenths. Mas maliit yung 7 kaysa sa 9. So, ang unahin natin is yung 7 tenths. Next natin is 9 tenths. So, next, pare-parehas na tayo may 1 na whole number. So, pinakamalit dito sa may whole number ay titignan natin yung tenths place. So, that is 0. Ito, 0. Ito ay 7. 9. Ito ay 0. So, ang next natin is 1 and 7 hundredths. So, dalawa na lang yung natitira. We have 1 and 7 tenths and 1 and 9 tenths. So, mas maliit yung 7 kesa sa 9. So, ang sunod natin is 1 and 7 tenths. Then, pinakamalaki natin is 1 and 9 tenths. So, yan. Kompleto na natin. Comparing, uh, comparing and arranging decimals are some of the techniques to determine the value of the given decimals. When you compare the numbers, first, look at the number of the digits in each number. Then, Compare the place values of the numbers with the same amount of digits. So we have here a problem. Team Nara and Team Hamahogany underwent a water challenge. Their task was to transfer the water in a cup from the first player to the tenth player without spilling within the allotted time. After the task, the team captain measured the water collected using a measuring cup. Team Nara collected 1 and 402 thousandths liters while Team Mahogany collected 1 and 45 thousandths liters of water. Which team got more water? So, ano yung mas madaming na collect na water? So, sino kaya ang panalo? So, the given, Team Nara collected 1 and 402 thousands liters and Team Mahogany collected 1 and 40,000, 45 thousands liters. So, titignan lang natin yung whole number part parehas na 1. So, next natin i-compare ay yung tenths place. So, yung tenths place dito is 4 and dito naman sa kabila is 0. So, ibig sabihin mas malaki tong 1 and 4. 402,000. So, therefore, Team Nara collected more water than Team Mahogany. Mas malaki yung 1 and 402,000. So, yun lang yung lesson natin for today. Sana natutunan yung mag-arrange and mag-compare na decimal numbers. Thank you for watching. Bye!